All right. I don't know how much you know about uh, about like looking at the chords or chord names or symbols, um, but basically here's a really quick chart I wrote out for the song. So we've got the intro, and then this is the verse, and this happens four times, and then this leads into the chorus ending with uh, this A7, and then it goes back uh, to here again. But, but what I was thinking is you could actually just look at that and pause it and then write it down yourself. So you can actually like follow the, uh, the chords as it goes. All right, but anyway, here, we'll take it, take it apart. The intro is F, C, B flat, C. So uh, it's gonna be five, six, seven, eighth fret, and this is the bar chord that everyone hates. Uh, I put my first finger there and then my ring finger across all three like that. Now uh, you'll see some people play it like this. I think that's even worse or harder for me but anyway the intros and then on that same fret you go to this E shape. It's what I call it. It's a C major chord because the root right there is C so it's F C, and then you take that same shape, and it's a whole step down, and then a whole step, whole step back up. Okay. Then the second time, it starts the same way, and then from there, it's a half step down. And what will really give you that sound of the song is take your pinky off, and it gives you what's called an A7, like that. Okay. And that's uh, for. So if it's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, bump into the next part. Um, I'll just play it in real time. The, the other thing you might be hearing on the very first chord, I don't know if it's two guitars or the guy decides to not play it that way because you're really hearing this note in there. So he could be playing it like this, just for the very first chord. Those three, and then this right there. That's definitely what the notes are. So, okay, so that's the intro. Um, the verse, this happens four times. It's uh, D minor. C, and then A7 for twice as long as the uh, D minor and C. So I think the easiest thing to do, because of the three chords together, is to go up to the 10th uh, fret and play a bar chord right here. It's the mi E minor shape of a bar chord. If you put the middle finger down right there, that's a D, that would be a D, the root here is D, that note is D. So. And here's something, I don't know if you care or not, but the E string, you find the root on the E string, and then you plug in something that looks like an E shape from the open chords. So D, and then an E minor looking shape is D minor. But if I put my middle finger down and it looks like E major, it's D major. Okay, so anyway, here's the, uh, here's the verse. This chord, D, D minor. And then a whole step down, but with the middle finger down, and that's C major. And then you're going to go to the 5th fret with the pinky off, which makes it A7. Okay, so that's what he's playing for that whole verse, which is... That kind of thing. And does it two more times. the verse then right from that as it's flowing through the song he just moves it up a half step and puts the pinky back down and that's called B, B flat major and he plays that then he plays uh, C then it kind of does the intro kind of thing F C B flat C F C B flat C, just like the intro, and then it moves on to another part, okay? So what I'm going to do now 
is I'll play the the last verse that we were just playing, but the last sequence of it into the next part, which we'll call the chorus or the last part. Okay, so here's the ver end of the verse. <laughs> is a D minor um, to C B flat to C these are all chords we've seen earlier in the song and then this time it changes D minor F C B flat A7 right back to the verse again and that's so as far as I got, I don't know if there was a bridge. I didn't listen that far ahead, but um, but you can definitely start with that. So what I'll do now, all right, now I'll just uh, play through the sequence of everything um, a little bit slower, just so you can see it. again. So that should start. You can feel free to ask me questions. I could probably tighten it up for you if you need it, but hopefully that gives you a start.